everyone. Hope you're all staying uh, safe, keeping well. Uh, for everyone who can't come to Rada at the minute, we hope to see you back here shortly. But in the meantime, I thought me and Joe would do something slightly differently at the moment. So we're going to try and help you with a little bit more on-course tuition. As you can see, we're on the first hole here. Um, but each week we're going to do one of the holes. So I'm starting on one, Joe's going to try and do two next week and so on and so forth. So we just thought we'd give you a little bit more of an idea as to what we kind of see or what we see as the best way to play the first hole today. Um, now for me the first hole is a little bit, little bit more of a risk reward hole. Um, two options for me, I've got a four iron here, but actually generally I'll take out the big dog and try and knock it on. Um, but it's a, it's a nice starting hole in a competition on a Saturday. If I had a card in my hand I'd probably be tending more towards the four iron and get it in play, let's try and make a birdie with a wedge in the hand. If you're playing against your mates, maybe match play and things like that, you might be to risk hitting the driver, but we'll see. So I'm just going to talk the way up the hole um, and I'll see you on the second shot then after a couple of shots. But first things first, let's get the four iron in play. So I'm going to see a little fade, that's my natural shot, but um, I'm just going to see it straight at that right trap and let's see what I can do. Just down the right half. So we'll see. Should be in the fairway. Right, a little bit more risk reward. We'll see where this one goes. Probably in slightly better shape than the four iron, actually, just short right to the green. So We'll see you on the second shot. Okay, here we are, where my four iron ended up. Um, it's probably about 200, 220 off the tee, I would think. It's got about 80 or 90 yards left. So I know for some of the amateurs or many of the amateurs, it might be a little bit more club off the tee than four iron, but I would say 200 to 220 off the tee is probably about perfect for the yardage that you want to be playing for your second shot. Um, so, like I said, I've got 80 or 90 yards. It's definitely a shot I could play with a lob wedge, but that, I don't believe that is the right shot. So I'm going to hit one a little bit softer with a sandwich. Try and pitch it out there probably. Maybe about 80 and just let it release a little bit to the hole. So we'll see what we can do. Okay, I pushed it a little bit. We we're about 20 foot for birdie, so I've got a chance. We'll see you uh, with the second shot for the driver now. Okay, here we are after the driver, so we're a little bit short of the green, a little bit into the wind and didn't quite get it, but I'm in good position after the driver. Um, the main thing is that it's in play, to be honest, so we've got a chance. So I've got a little, slightly awkward lie with the bunker in the way, just a touch, so I've got to be careful of that. So I am, I have taken out the most lofted wedge in the bag now, so I am going for the lob wedge. All I'm looking to do is kind of a high, softer landing shot. Um, fingers crossed we'll knock it inside the other one. Let's see what happens. Looks a little bit more like it. We'll see you on the green. Okay, here we are on the green. Um, I'll give myself two decent looks at birdie. First things first though, I will say, let's just get the pitch marks. That one there, I'll get the other one in a second. Um, so my four iron, conservative play. I've given myself a chance, not the best shot in the world, I will say. A little bit pushed, but I've given myself a chance. Almost pretty high. So, I've got about 20 foot as you can see. Quickish green, slightly down the hill, slightly right to left. Main thing is I don't want to be tanking it six foot past in a competition and giving myself a bit of a nervy one to start off with. So let's give it a chance, but let's just uh, roll it up to the hole. If it goes in, it's a bit of a bonus. I hit a good putt, okay. I made my par. It would have been great to make birdie, but a conservative one made past. Birdie one, 
to the driver. Where's that other pitch mark? Let's just grab that quickly. There she is. To the driver one. I'm actually going to give myself that. It's probably just over 18 inches. Luckily, I'm not playing in a competition, so I can do that. Those are your two options to play the first, though. The widest part of the fairway is probably around about 200 off the tee. Gives you a really nice second shot, yardage of just under 100 yards. It's probably the best way to play it. The bigger guys, the, the longer hitters, can definitely go for the green. Give yourself front edge, maybe just short. Get it a little bit uh, higher into the green and give yourself a good birdie chance. We'll see you next week for Joe's Pro's Tip on the second.